Globe's host Ricky Gervais is going to see a lot of tan faces when he takes the stage Sunday on NBC for the fifth time. I did it the first time because it was a big opportunity, it was very flattering. Then they invited me back, I thought I will do it again because I think I can do a better job. I haven't even seen the tourists. Who has? After the second, everyone said I'd never be invited back. Have you seen the tourist yet? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> I did it as a fourth time. Relax, I'm gonna try and be nice. But this is the last time. There's a limit. There is a limit. Ricky revealed he's not getting drunk and improvising his jabs. He actually spends a lot of time writing those insults we love. It's not to be taken seriously because we're all gonna die soon. Ricky's jokes won't fall flat and neither will the Moet. The official champagne of the Golden Globes, there will be 750 bottles plus 1,500 minis and 500 golden hour cocktails. And this year, for the first time, the Globes are going vegan. 120 cooks and 300 servers will plate some 10,000 meals throughout the night. Leo was quick to praise the move to a plant-based menu. The main course will be mushroom scallops. They're king oyster mushrooms that are cut and cooked to appear like scallops. And the stars surely won't skip any of the 1,200 dessert plates. And they can start on their diets again on Monday. <laughs> Meanwhile, back on the red carpet, we are bringing back our very own Lucky Charm. Miss Sharon Osborne will be back to interview and gush over all the stars. Um, she also doesn't mind putting them in their place. Oh, no, that's why we love her. No fear and no filter.